So the tradition of Penny Lane started way before my time, but the story goes that there were some students that attended a Beatles concert and they were so ecstatic and it was such a great concert that when they came back to campus, they um, skipped down the stretch of sidewalk and were singing Penny Lane. So that's kind of where it got its name. And the tradition is for um, every year to start off homecoming, all the clubs, orgs, and sports on campus, they paint a square to show off um, what their sport or organization is or their club on campus and they design the squares themselves and then they paint them themselves as well. It really just gives us a way to express ourselves um, on a campus and give a real artistic feel to it. It brings out the artist in me. You know, it's fun, it's a, a good team exercise. You get to bond as a team, be out here, you know, paint. And it's, everybody comes up with ideas to put on the school. Uh, it's great to see everybody else out here. I mean, it's kind of a, you know, obviously a kickoff to homecoming week. And it's a great way to spend the Sunday and you see all the different teams out here. You know, it's just another, to me, it's just another example of the campus community coming together, you know, on a nice Sunday afternoon. It's just a really good tradition to be a part of and represent all the groups that everyone's a part of. And, you know, every day most people walk Penny Lane and it's just a really cool thing to see all the groups and organizations that are part of this college. Penny Lane is a really great opportunity where all of the sports come together and get to paint a square. It's super awesome because when we come on visits, we get to show our school spirit by having our squares painted. And it's just a really fun thing to make sure that all of our sports are represented. And every time you walk to class, you walk on Penny Lane. So getting to be reminded of all the amazing things that Q has to offer every single day.